Oh my gosh, you guys, I cannot believe I am saying this, but pack with me to go to New York. Like, I am so excited. Pablo and I are leaving for New York in 72 hours. I have not packed anything, but I'm so excited. We found a really good deal for the whole, like, Black Friday, Cyber Monday, Travel Tuesday kind of weekend that was going on. And so we're going to New York now, which is so crazy. I can't believe it's happening, but I literally feel like we're always planning things super last minute. I have, like, somewhat of an itinerary, but that's... That's going to be in another video. I am 100% going to be vlogging that as well since it is Vlogmas. If you don't know, I am posting every other day for the entire month of December. Perfect timing because Anna Luisa is also from New York as well. If you haven't heard of them, they are a great quality affordable jewelry brand and they are currently having their biggest sale of the year with up to 35% off. I have so much jewelry for them and I absolutely love them. So they sent over three more items and I'm so excited to open this and show you guys everything that I picked. And then of course, packing for New York which I can't believe that I'm saying that still, but without further ado, let's get right into it. They are based in New York and currently having their biggest sale of the year They do have fast and free shipping for all of the US and outside of the US if you do not live there They do have affordable shipping prices as well jewelry starts at $39 So it's very affordable and great quality, which I love and I am so excited I got to pick out three extra pieces at this time Which as mentioned in the other video I am trying to create like my perfect tea stack for my bracelets I do have some earrings as well. I like to mix silver and gold so I wear my silver Tiffany's that Pablo got me and then I have my Ana Luisa gold hoops as well but these are the little travel pouches that they came in this time I am actually going to be packing this one specifically I really like the size of this one so first up we are starting with a gold necklace this is their Ina necklace I kind of think Pablo might steal this from me which is totally fine if he does it probably will look great on him this has a 16 inch chain I am loving this it is perfect and wait Wait till you guys see what I got to go along with it. This is their Atlas bracelet. It retails for $85 and the necklace is $115, which I seriously, I'm in love with this necklace. And then to match it, the bracelet as well, the stack is coming along so nicely together. This is their Lisa bracelet and it retails for $90 Canadian. And this is what my little bracelet stack is looking like from Ana Luisa. Honestly, great quality pieces without breaking the bank. Like seriously, love that. If you want to purchase it for somebody you know, or for yourself up to 35% off moving on we got a pack for New York again I only have 72 hours and I'm a little bit stressed because I'm already over packing I feel like I'm better at packing a carry-on for longer trips because when we're going shorter trips I feel like I just want to pack everything but we're gonna see how we do I just have a bunch of stuff from Italy still in my luggage so like the packing cubes all of that you guys should already know first thing is this. I actually have two. I have the burgundy one and the black one. These are the best bags that Lululemon has ever came out with for traveling. I'm so sad that it got discontinued so I can't link these for you. I've shown this a million times. Every time I go traveling, this is the bag that I bring because it completely just extends to a personal size bag and I love that there's no structure to this so you can just stuff it and stuff it and stuff it. It also has like that so it's like one of those shoulder bags and it is massive i've never had an issue with the size of it for a personal item so i absolutely love that i'm not gonna bring it full on the way there but on the way back it's probably gonna be filled of stuff that i purchased while i was there if this ever comes back in stock i think it's like the packable 30 inch tote bag packable tote bag something like that snatch it up another thing that my mom actually gave me is this airtight seal i don't know what it's called completely but it is one of those bags where you just put a bunch of stuff in and then you just suction the whole air out of it and it is like so tiny i brought it with me to italy and i could not believe everything that fit into it without this little bag i probably would not have been able to bring everything that i brought so i am also gonna pack this as well i'm actually gonna ask my mom for a second one because her and my dad 
were the ones that bought these i think off of amazon or something and they are so useful so i'm gonna bring one for myself and then i'm also gonna ask them for a second one so i can give one to pablo as well okay first up we have pajamas which i have three different pajamas in my hands right now we're only going there for three nights so do i need a different pajama for every single night no but i honestly don't know which one I want to leave like this one is so cute this is from Shein and this is the top for it second one that I'm also thinking about same style just a different pattern which this one has little hearts on it third option is honestly just one of these really cute lounge t-shirt dress vibe to it very comfy very cozy and then it comes with some underwear underneath it like little shorts so I don't really know which one I want to go with if I just want to be like very comfy and just lounge around in this or if I want to have a matching set also for all, we have packing cubes so I am going to start putting them in my packing cubes these ones are again from Lululemon I swear Lululemon just solves all my problems so I love that I think I'm going to use this one for pajamas and socks if I remember correctly that's how I did it for Italy and it worked out nice this one you can expand it so I do it like that and then once everything is inside I kind of like squish it in and then I zip it up so it's more compact. I think I am going to go with the Shein set. It's going to take up a little bit less space and I don't really sleep with long sleeves so I don't know how comfortable I would find the other set. And then socks. I'm probably going to overpack my socks just because A it's winter, it's cold there and B we're going to go skating. Every time I go skating I don't know my socks just feel like cold and wet so in case that happens also don't know if it's going to snow there so just want to cover all my bases. I would rather just not walk around New York with wet and like cold socks and especially because I have white socks that's all I really know so we're just gonna pack a couple of extra socks just in case one pair two pairs three pairs four five six six pairs of socks we have three like ankle sock ones so those are going in there and three long socks plain white ones from aritzia and then these ones i think they're from roots i don't really remember but i do have a hat and mitten set that also matches this so i think it'll be cute to just have this peeking through my boots i got underwear as well obviously not going to show you that because you don't need to know my underwear situation but just know i am packing underwear so this is what it's currently looking like honestly i feel like i can fit a lot more in here but we're only going for three days don't really need a lot maybe i will stuff in a hat actually but to be determined this is what it looks like right now probably will end up adding my hats and mittens in here as well just to make that extra room in my suitcase okay outfits is where i kind of start getting into trouble because i don't know what i want to bring two bottom options not bringing jeans not bringing anything else except sweatpants which is going to be my airport outfit this honestly will look better with the black so i think i'm going to go ahead and bring this so this one is a yes for sure that's one outfit scuba and the espresso leggings are a yes outfit number two i do also want to bring this which this is the align mock neck long sleeve okay these are accessories which i actually can't find my hat and mittens that match the socks i showed you guys so i'm gonna have to ask my mom maybe she knows where they are but those are definitely coming with me if i can find them i am completely overpacking i'm a little stressed but earmuffs i want one of those like skating photos in central park everybody has earmuffs and like cute little scarves so i feel like i want that these are also very comfortable i actually got them from dollarama last year and honestly for like two three dollars i feel like they're perfect i love them they're a great size very fuzzy so i feel like i want to bring them i don't know do we like earmuffs or not i'm not sure if it's everybody's cup of tea also this hat could potentially come with me because I love it that it's just white basic very cute in my opinion my uncle actually gave this to me with my little cousin and I just love it this is actually like my favorite hat ever it's just white basic plain I love that matches everything so that's gonna come along actually that's gonna look so cute with the full espresso set as well also have mittens from Lululemon these ones are great because they're very comfy on the inside and then they also can just go like this for if i need to pull out the camera click anything take pictures anything like that so these are definitely coming along as well and they have the matching hats which is just black with a little pom-pom this is currently on the website it has a bunch of different colors aritzia scarves are we still wearing those this year i have no idea but i have two of them that are like the blanket ones like this if you want very comfy very cozy it's gonna keep me nice and warm or you just hold it like this as well but i don't know 
if I want to bring it with me. I think I'm going to bring this sweater. I'm looking at my hoodies and I just, I don't know, for some reason, the scubas are just not speaking to me. So I think I'm going to bring this as a sweater as well because I am looking at a jacket that I might look nice with also. So this is the winner. We're just going to go plain, simple, why complicate life, you know what I'm saying? And then jackets. I'm going to show you guys my jacket options and honestly, like, this is where it's going to start getting a little bit harder as well. I have a pretty big jacket collection. I think I have like 20 different jackets, but but as mentioned, I picked out four different jackets that I potentially want to bring with me. Not potentially, I would bring them all if I could, but being realistic, like look at my luggage, it's already exploding. The four jackets will not fit there. Like that's just not doable. So we're going to start off with the jacket that I know 100% no matter what is coming with me. This is the Slee Street jacket. As you can see, it goes kind of a little bit below my bum. Very flattering. Simple black also goes in. You can shape it as it does have cords on at the inside so you can make it a little bit tighter around the waist to give you a nicer shape. This is a size 4. It is pricey but highly recommend it. So this is absolutely the jacket that I am bringing with me. One that I'm iffy on is this pink one which Pablo and I got while we were in Banff. It's the exact same one as the black one just in a brighter kind of pink color. I feel like it's cute because you stand out and that's what I like about it. I also like wearing it with the white hat like this. But I feel like the outfits I'm choosing right now probably won't match it. Like I don't see it really matching with the espresso leggings. Obviously it'll match with black but I think we're going to rule this one out just for this trip. Next one I'm deciding is between the cropped Wonder Puff again from Lululemon. I really like this like little pink color that it has. I feel like this with the brown would be nice. It's also not as long as the other one, but it is more puffy, so it's not as like form fitting and flattering as the other one. But I feel like it's just a cute pink color to take pictures with. Skating as well with like an all black outfit like this or the brown outfit. And having this little hat, I feel like might be a cute outfit. So I think this is also gonna come. But I also wanted this one because I don't know how cold it's gonna be and this is from aritzia this is the anton parka if i remember correctly pablo and i actually got this at the outlet a heavy duty jacket but it is so pretty as well like even just the color and the hood as well is so nice it is very long if you guys can kind of see that maybe for skating this jacket but also like i don't know if it's just too heavy i could wear this one on the airplane but it is a little bit heavy, like just the jacket itself. Very warm though, but so is the black one. This one also doesn't have zippered pockets while the other ones do. Honestly, I wish I had that black jacket in this color. It would be perfect. You can also take off the fur hood. I might like it better without the little fur as well. So let's try that. I'm gonna stick to the light pink and the black because I could be here for like another half an hour deciding if I need to bring this or not. And honestly, Realistically, it's just too heavy, but it's really cute, so I will have to wear it. I'm just going to put the fur back on. I was just searching Lululemon, and they have this jacket, which is the black one and the pink one that I showed you in the color Nomad, which I think is close to the color of the Aritzia one that I have, but personally, I really like these jackets. They're very lightweight, but very warm, so... I think I'm gonna have to order that when I come back because I really do like the color of the other one, but I like the fit of this more. So we're gonna bring this pink one and the black one. I think pink also looks really nice with this, but now I'm also thinking if I should bring another pair of leggings and maybe an outfit that will go good with the pink. I could also go shopping and buy outfits there, which is another thing to consider. I don't have to bring everything because if I'm missing an outfit, what better excuse than to go buy a brand new one from New York? So that's also an option. I'm seriously all over the place. Like my head just doesn't even know where to start. I was also just thinking about an airport outfit, which this is my go-to airport outfit. The gray lounge set. I absolutely love this set. Also do have a lighter color. This is more of a white one. Same exact set. And I think either of them would work. But then we also have the new one that lounge came out with, which is this oversized like hoodie and sweatpants. So neutral outfits we got three of them not sure which one i want to go with but i think i'm gonna have to wear the black jacket because it is a little bit bigger than the pink jacket it just makes more sense for me to pack this in my suitcase and this one will match all three of them which is also nice and then same with the black the black one will match anyone so 
I don't know if I want to go and just, you know, stick to what I know and love, which is the gray set. I feel like it's just so pretty, so comfortable. And I honestly, truly get so many compliments on this any time that I wear it, even if I'm just going to Starbucks, like people have stopped me and asked me where it's from. If I'm just shopping at the mall also, I've gotten stopped and asked where this is from. So I think I just want to do it. But honestly, how many times can I wear this? Just like an outfit uniform at this point, but also... This one is nice too, but I don't want to get it dirty since it is more of a white color. This one is also really pretty too, but it's more on like the baggy kind of fit. I think we're just going to go with that one, but if you see me in the airport with it again, mind your business because I am just going to be wearing it. It's my favorite outfit, honestly. It's just so comfortable. Honestly, I don't know why. I picked two other options because my heart knew we were going to go with this one. We're going to try to get this entire mess into this one tiny packing cube can we do it i don't know i'm hoping so i'm gonna do a time lapse before you guys to see if we can fit everything shoe options i have these like black juicy couture ones which are very dirty but they have like the bows that have black and gold at the back as you can see i feel like that'll be really pretty also have these ones which honestly these are also really nice very comfortable to walk in but i also have white ones as well which i might end up wearing the white ones instead of the brown one maybe the white ones are definitely a safe option not too sure where my white ones are right now but We'll have to check later. So this is what the jacket looks like. It's pretty big. Obviously, we can squish it down a little bit more because it's just the jacket. And this is what's great, too, about the airtight bags, which you probably like. Why don't you just put it in there? I don't like putting it in there because if I do, then I'll have a lot of room and I'll just overpack. But if I have it like this, yes, these help. But trust me, on the way back, I'll kind of show you guys how I pack. And you'll see the difference. Like, those things are magic. Those, like, vacuum seal bags, they're magic. So this just is in the meantime, so I don't overpack. I'm actually going to get the white boots. I'm going to go find them. So I'll be right back so you guys can see and I can finish packing. I ended up finding the white boots. These are them. They're chunky. They're good. I feel like if it rains or snows, these are going to be a good option. But I also found these ones as well, which these ones are so cute as well. I'm so stressed. I don't know if I want to bring these ones now. I feel like they're very pretty. But the problem is, will they match like the pink jacket because obviously i would wear it if i wear the all brown outfit which i would wear the pink i feel like these white ones are safe because they can go with everything so i feel like these are the ones that i'm going for i did wear them in banff as well last year when pablo and i went it was like negative 40 and these boots kept me nice dry and warm so definitely gonna pack these ones i think they're really cute as well i honestly can't remember where i got them from maybe winners but not a hundred percent sure so we have that airport outfit is going to be the juicy boots which are these ones i will dust them off and clean them so it's going to be the track suit with the jacket and the boots to tie everything together i feel like that is a safe and good option also going to be bringing this which this is the city adventure belt bag by lululemon this is a must i showed it in a haul and i will never stop raving about this i think it's perfect so i should pack some stuff i'm not going to pack everything in this just yet gum and my jewelry as well i will be bringing it again like i said in the anna louisa pouch we also have the makeup which as you guys can see i am a little bit overpacked because we do have to also pack the hair straightener as well but i think this is everything that the suitcase can handle as of right now so we're gonna see if this can close but some skincare stuff that i can just quickly throw deodorant bringing a razor i don't know if you can bring these on the plane i usually don't but i don't want to go there and buy one also got these toothbrushes today actually from home sense it was like five of them for 7.99 so i'm gonna go with the like nude 
color so we're gonna pack a toothbrush knee toothpaste and i picked this one up i thought this was like the whitening one but apparently it's for sensitive gums which i don't have sensitive gums this one is also gonna go in there packing this like lip liner that i actually got today as well this is soft beige from essence it says eight hour matte which i'm actually wearing on my lips right now but i topped it with the sunday riley brown sugar little gloss that they have as well so i'm gonna pack this also hair clips these are my favorite they're so cute they have little hearts on them they are from marshall's but i use them when i'm putting my makeup on to just hold the hair back so packing two of them one on each side of course and then obviously the skincare i'm going to be using it for the next two days so i will pack that after also have cash that i'm going to put in the city adventure little belt bag as well as our passports as well i need to pack that because i have both of them also a little perfume sample that i got from my favorite perfume this is good girl by carolina herrera got this during the beauty insider sale which it goes like halfway if you guys can see that i have not used it this is the first time i actually took it out of the bag so it kind of sucks that it's that tiny but this is also gonna go on there so so far that's everything that i have I'm gonna put my makeup on the other side and it does also come with a mirror which is nice but everything fits i think so far and again i do have one bag for the carry on personal item so everything fits nice that is everything that i'm packing for new york which is so crazy i can't believe i'm saying that so but 72 hours i will be at the airport which is insane if you're watching this when i upload it i actually just finished my first full day there pablo and i arriving a sunday morning and i believe this is going up sunday afternoon 7 p.m ish so check out my instagram for photos and everything that we do over there and then also stay tuned here make sure you subscribe to that bell notification so you can see vlog content i'm so excited for christmas in new york and again vlogmas is going on right now so i am posting every other day for the entire month of December. December, also posting shorts in between so sometimes I might even post every single day for a full week which is kind of crazy but you don't want to miss that check out for the giveaway that I have going on and how you can enter thank you guys so much for watching as well as Anna Luisa they are having their biggest sale of the year don't forget for up to 35% off seriously how pretty is this necklace and all the bracelets and everything they have such great pieces click the link in the description to shop and I will see you guys in my next video bye